Federal Funding Withdrawal After 16 years of construction, California's high-speed rail project has yet to complete any operational track. The Federal Railroad Administration released a critical report stating the project violated federal grant terms and lacked a viable path to on-time, within budget completion. As a result, the Biden administration announced plans to withdraw $4 billion in federal funding, calling the project a boondoggle. California lawmakers criticized the decision, while the California High-Speed Rail Authority vowed to continue construction, relying on state funding. Major Delays and Cost Overruns Originally approved in 2008, the rail was supposed to connect Los Angeles and San Francisco in under three hours by 2020. However, the projected cost ballooned from $33 billion to $128 billion, and the route was reduced to a 119-mile stretch between Merced and Bakersfield, expected to be completed by 2033. The slow progress has fueled criticism that America struggles to build large-scale infrastructure, especially compared to Europe and Asia's high-speed rail networks. Legal and Environmental Barriers Governor Gavin Newsom and the California High-Speed Rail Authority blame delays on legal battles over private land acquisition. The train route cuts through valuable farmland, requiring complex litigation over fair compensation for 2,270 private properties. Additionally, federal and state environmental regulations prolonged the review process, which only concluded last year. Funding access issues have further complicated construction timelines. Route controversies and alternative proposals. Critics argue that the chosen route unnecessarily disrupts farmland, sparking legal resistance from Central Valley farmers. Some experts suggest building along Interstate 5 to avoid eminent domain battles, a strategy used by Brightline West, a private rail project linking Los Angeles and Las Vegas. Others believe California overextended itself by including rural communities and committing to 220 miles per hour speeds instead of focusing on a direct LA, SF connection or upgrading existing tracks. Future prospects. Despite federal funding cuts, California plans to seek private investors to complete the project. However, securing investment may require guaranteeing a full LA, SF connection. The California High-Speed Rail Authority has 30 days to challenge the federal report and attempt to retain funding.